Gene and I are going to do it. I'm going to attack him, and Gene's going to just evade the force. So if I come at him here, he's just going to get out of the way, right? Now there's an open limb here. He's going to attack the weapon very limb. Or he may, let's say I, I cross it over here, and you're going to go this way, just kind of evade here. This hand might be closer, so he may be attacking the non weapon bearing limb. But the whole point is we're trying to defang the snake, the snake being the fangs of the stick, the stick being the fangs. Take away the fangs. You don't have to worry about the, uh, the snake quite as much, right? All right, so he's gonna evade. He's gonna whack fairly hard on the padded forearm. Remember, it's whatever's closest. It doesn't have to be the same stick every time, right? slow like that as you progress we go a lot faster we move around and those wax again are going to cause a disruption in the pattern of thinking I might have the plans to go boom 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 but after that first strike that he evades and he strikes me hopefully he gets a disarm out of it at the very least it's going to bruise me up more and more and a couple more strikes are going to finish the job so practice that <laughs> 